traditional therapy for organ-confined prostate cancer has been surgical removal, that is radical prostatectomy, and that can be done either through a large incision, so-called open surgery, it can be done laparoscopically through minimally invasive surgery, or it can be done laparoscopically with robotic assist, the, the da Vinci technique, which is a very widespread in prostate cancer surgery circles at the moment. Alternate treatments involve radiation, ionizing radiation, which can be delivered by external beam or seed implant, or more recently by a device called CyberKnife. I would say the latter has yet to prove itself effective, but radiation treatment is one of the traditional methods of treating prostate cancer. As prostate cancer has been diagnosed at earlier and earlier stages, some individuals have recommended a process called watchful waiting, or more recently active surveillance, in which the disease is followed closely in the hopes that it does not progress uh, and that the patient can avoid treatment and thus avoid side effects of treatment for a period of time. Whether or not someone is a candidate for active surveillance depends on age, Gleason grade, and, uh, and uh, extent of local disease. Uh, Ablotherm Haifu is a very safe, non-invasive ambulatory treatment for prostate cancer. Uh, Ablotherm Haifu is computer controlled, so it's very precise, it's very safe, and it produces minimal, not zero, but minimal side effects. It's very well tolerated. It's an in and out procedure the same day, especially important in younger patients who have significant life expectancies and want to live life as free of complications and side effects as possible.